Hello everybody, welcome back to the Rusty Traveler. So today we're in Vietnam on the island of Phu Hoa and we're going to be traveling on the world's longest cable car and then we're going to um, go to Venice. So we're going to go on the Gan Han Thoi uh, cable car here in Phu Hoa. It's pretty wild here. Look, it's Venice in behind me and then we've got some ruins here. You know what I mean? And then we've got unbelievable high development in behind already heavily developed. So it's pretty cool. Pretty cool here. Lots going on here in Fuquan. Going on a cable car ride. I'm not sure where to, what we're going to do there. I sort of learn as I go. So this is really quite an experience. So here we go. We're going to be traveling from Anthoi on the mainland to the final island of Phuong Thong. We will be touching over a two other islands on the way there, but we won't be uh, able to get up. There's only one station up here. Uh, at the end, you'll find a beautiful theme park that's opened up, which is basically a really cool water park and uh, a nice beach area. It's a great day for the family. And at the end of the day, they take you back here. So as we take off and we go over what looks like Italy, I think I have to mention the company Vin Pearl uh, Corporation. They own the island and this is all of their development as well as the uh, development you're going to see near the end, which is uh, Venice. So it really is beautiful. It's very well done. It's up to you whether you feel it's overdevelopment or the right development. So sorry guys, but a little trick of video here. We left, uh, went to the island, and then now we're landing back to where we left from. It's actually a composition of two videos that I shot. Unfortunately, it has some bad weather, so I'm trying to pick the stuff that looks the best. So now we're coming back from the island and uh, back to reality. I'm not sure. I didn't know Europe was there to be a town. Apparently it is now. So. Uh, for sure, stay to the end of this video because there's something coming up that's going to absolutely amaze you. And this is not clickbait. So hang in there, guys. I promise you it'll be worth it. And while you're sitting there doing nothing, why don't you subscribe to the Rusty Traveler? And of course, turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our videos here in Southeast Asia or as we continue to travel around the world. Can't see, I didn't warn you guys. 
because now we're in Venice. Actually, we're not in Venice. We're still on the island of Papua, the Grand World Resort. Uh, this is part of their development here. There's also a large theme park and an animal park. But this place was so beautiful. We arrived at uh, sunset. So uh, the nice Vietnamese family I was traveling with at the time, they got a lot of pictures in and uh, really enjoyed it. We went for coffee and ice cream. Then a big storm came in and blew us away, basically. But this place was crazy. Check this out. It's like Venice, but way more color. Really hard to beat the amazing Vietnam. The uh, resort is actually, uh, a lot of it's a hotel uh, where you can stay, most of it, and uh, it is uh, festooned with coffee shops, ice cream shops, souvenir shops. It really is neat. It does give you a European feel. Somebody dropped you there and opened your eyes. You would think, uh, I'm in Europe somewhere, probably Venice. But you would say, uh, wow, Venice is in way better shape than I thought it would be in. <laughs> Uh, but what a wonderful experience. What an incredible surprise. Thanks so much, everybody, for supporting the Rusty Traveler by watching this video. So put the island of Fuqua on your bucket list in Vietnam. It is a must-see travel destination in Asia. But for now, take care, and we'll see you on the road.